One, two, three, go for it. Hey, there we go, there we go. Well, I think the mobile food hubs just speaks for itself, really. Um, they were using quite an old van last time. They've now got this beautiful new shiny van, so much bigger, um, able to present all the food in a much more attractive fashion. I think they've done tremendously. And uh, in South Cambridgeshire District Council, we were delighted to be able to make an award of £15,000 from our Zero Carbons Communities Grant in order to help them purchase this. And well done to everyone from Hope CIC for or raising you know almost as much again from other sources. Guys at Hope CIC have done an amazing job in getting us to the point where we are now and I know that their work's going to continue. I mean it's uh, you know you can see from you know, the amount of people that have come to the opening here just the impact and the effect it's going to have on the local community. I mean this really is to help the people that do need it the most so you know the fact that we as a council have been able to support that is a really great initiative and you know hats off to absolutely everyone involved for getting us to the point that we're at now. There are so many benefits to the mobile food hub that you really can't single anyone out. The fact that this vehicle is electric is great because it reduces their carbon footprint. The very fact they've got a food hub means that they're really reducing the amount of food waste going into landfill. And then, you know, we've heard today while we've had the very exciting launch of this about what a massive difference this has made to thousands of people's lives, not just feeding them, but giving them opportunities to volunteer, in some cases having a serious impact on people's quality of life and you know dealing with people in real distress but giving giving them hope which is what this is all, this is all about The social impact, I think, is probably my, my favourite benefit. Obviously, you know, this isn't just a mobile food hub for, you know, for, for giving out food to people. It's also, um, you know, a community point where people can come, they can sit, they can talk. Um, and, you know, they can also see that they're not the only ones in, you know, a challenging situation that they might be in. So for me, it's not just, you know, the, the, sort, you know, the charitable act. It's the actual um, bringing together of people with shared experiences. The, the demand was increasing. So we we've been asked to visit certain villages. We will start. We started with six. Now we are doing nine. So if the time is more consumed. So we were concerned about the timing because when we get to the sites, we need to set up everything. It takes about half an hour to pack it, and then that that time is we're wasting. So we're going to use those time. I mean that, that time that we are saving from using the big bang um, to serve more villages.